So today I have received a GE one in one light white uh, 40 watt single LED grow light. So I'm gonna go ahead and do an unboxing with you guys today. How about that? So this came in the mail overnight, I guess around six, but I wasn't able to um, notice it until this morning so today we are going to unbox it it's a strange packaging let's see what it looks like in here yeah so they do sell this at the big box store like um, Lowe's and maybe Home Depot I ordered this online as a matter of fact I think yeah it was through an auction site an auction website I won this bid so the price I paid for was actually different than the price that was online so let's take a look here oh, let me just put it on this side and cut up all the opening so obviously this is not the box that it normally comes in, but here it is. Okay, um, let's take a look here. So as I mentioned, this is a GE Glow LED light. What I'm gonna use this for, actually, is gonna be my um, in how in the house plants. Um, if you guys seen my last not last video but all of my video, um, I do bring my plants indoor for the winter, and this will be a good addition to it. It's gonna be LED, so it you don't have to worry about breaking anything. So let's go ahead and open this up. It's good for um, flowers and fruits, so it's a small 24 inch. Let's see if I can find a tab somewhere here. Uh, I guess you just open this up. No? Okay, well. Let's just open it through here. So I open it on the side. Yeah, this one has a low energy use flow to heat with the LED lights. So it's 40 watts, 25,000 hours of life. Whoa. Let's see. Obviously, it's non-dimmable. So, let's take a quick peek. Looks like it comes with a manual. So, let me make this clear. This is not sponsored by GE or anything like that. I just need one of this. And I want to show you guys what it looks like if you are to buy one. So yeah, there's a shorter one, 24 inch, and there's a longer one. So I got the shorter of the two. And wow, that looks pretty neat. 
this is all LED and the the covering of the LED looks like a tube it looks like your fluorescent tube how you make it in the past and look at this I don't know if you can see this real well or not it's it comes with an extra outlet so that's pretty cool nice <clears throat> oh on this end is your on and off switch and basically you just plug it in it's very now if you set it flat it's like it rocks but I think we're gonna need to have some kind of attachment to hang it we'll have to look into finding one of those so yeah, this would be great for planting uh, tomatoes, cucumbers, and peppers, and fruit or flowering stage of the growth inside the house. Oh wait, there is some kind of cable, uh, piece of uh, attachment that came with it. Look at that, sweet. So basically, you hook one here. like so and then you find another spot to hook this up to let me see the other side here this is uh, great for hanging above your plants So it does come with a little uh, hanging piece. So you could use that to hang your um, fixture, light fixture, where, however you want. So let's test it out. Let's go ahead and plug this in. Oh, wow. That is really bright. I don't know if you can see it. I just lift it up. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna blind you, so here we go. There's the LEDs. Wow. Super strong. Yeah. So this will make for great growing. I plant over here, I like it. <laughs> but yeah, so here's the on and off switch. There's the off and on there nice so i'm going to talk about reliabilities so i'm going to um, let you know that reliability is something that you learn and you learn about this product as as you go the longer time you have it um and the longer time you the let me let me cut okay so i'm going to talk about reliabilities um of course it is for something that you learn about as you own the product for a long period of time as for now, I have no problem with reliability with it. Uh, the quality, I feel like this fixture is well made. It's made out of metal here. I'm really happy with it. Um, it just looks like any other fixture. It's very well made. I think it's um, well done. And it's, you know, the, the kind of uh, size that I'm looking for, a 24 inch, small enough to fit uh, above where I need it to be. Um, so yeah, the I'm pretty impressed with how small this is. Um, and it's quality, it's well made. The, look at this um, power, power uh, cord here. It's really well made as well. The quality feels 
like it's could plug in and turn on for a while now for the price this thing goes about 60 69 dollars at home depot or at lowe's uh, for me the price is really really good because i i placed a, an order online and i think i paid f about 30 38 plus shipping so maybe around 40 45 dollars for this but uh that's a pretty good price anyway if you get it through uh, Home Depot or Lowe's just see maybe you can get a, a deals but yeah for price wise that's one of the reason I bought it I uh, found a deal on this uh, as far as functionality goes it's very simple to use um, I didn't even look at the manual on this one um, the instruction out of the box uh, it's very self-explanatory because you have just an extension to uh, add the plug into another outlet and then you just have it on and off. There's no bulbs you have to take out and put in. It's all built into the fixture. So um, for usability, the product is very intuitive and easy to use and the functionality, there's no need for manual. Even for the hook, I could just hook it and just find something to hang it to. I think it's very easy to use. Anyway guys, if you have never seen any of my other video before, go ahead and check out my channel. I do um, different variety of video from uh, outdoor backyard to um, going shopping. So it's very, uh, broad and if you like to check it out go ahead and subscribe to that channel to my channel if you like what this video give me a thumbs up it really helps me out and if you like my cat give her a thumbs up too anyway guys um, I'll talk to you guys later I'll see ya peace Okay guys, so this is the new um, the new fixture that I got today. So as you can see, it's shorter or smaller than the one that I have originally. So if I step back a little bit, you can see that it's just hanging right above it. So that it's just shine through. Now, look how bright it is. It's so much brighter. So let's look at my plants. Um, I'm gonna turn it off and turn it on. So this is on, everything's nice and green. And here is off. Look at that. So, I mean, this light fixture, the one here, does a lot of work, but if I turn this on, it makes it so much brighter also. Look at that. So yeah, that is the new fixture. The small one I have, and there it is, all hooked up. And I think it's gonna get the job done. So yeah, I have it set it on a, um, on a timer. So every night, it was shut off on its own. It goes to this green, the green one plugs into the timer. And the timer has these two plugs for the fixture, the, the big fixture and the small fixture up here. But it's all connected to the, um, you call it the studs, I guess, up here. And oh yeah, and that light right there, and that is also a glow light. So we have three glow light that comes down. But the top one is not very strong. It's very weak. But this one, the small light fixture should be sufficient. But yeah, my water hyacinths is 
it's okay. I, I mean, it's got its day, but I think um, I have about two two more months or so. Let's hope it survive. But anyway, guys, that's all I want to show you. Peace.